So the final race then of an action-packed day one of the new season is the National Hunt Flat Race. And it's Asiano Commander for Hims. The top one, Montparnasse Redwood for Martin Leedham. Shogun for Leon van Rensburg. Tiger Moth for Paul Rhodes. Tyrrhenian Sunshine for James Shea. Destiny Ruby for Graham Klutzbuck. And Marjorie Narnia for David Robertson. So small field then. And we know they're all going to get red. And just two trainers will fail to pick up some cash and tiger moth is the first one to show leads by about two lengths yeah, marjorie narnia being pushed up in a second and montparnasse redwood just the back market so tiger moth and it is to give paul rhodes his first winner of the season of the Sticks. Even though this isn't over the sticks, of course, it's the National Hunt Flat Race. But it's Tiger Moth in the lead from Asiano Commander in second. Past the winning post there, circuit to go. Marjorie Nana is third, Shogun is fourth, and Destiny Ruby fifth, Tyrrhenian Sunshine is sixth, and Montparnasse Redwood is just the back marker in seventh. As they make their way onto the back straight, and Tiger Moth is clear in front. Asiano Commander. Marjorie Narnia is in third. An interesting opening day of the season. Grand Club's about three winners. Josh Russell and three wins, I think. Okay. Leon's had two. Daniel French took the opener. And John Morgan's had one as well. Tiger Moth in front. From Asiano Commander. One of the races was a dead heat as well. Plenty of action, lots of fallers in the chases. Well, last race was action packed. This one probably not going to be quite so action packed. It's a two mile National Hawks flat race, and Tiger Moth is the leader by about four lengths to Asiano Commander in second, and then Marjorie Nine is third, Destiny Ruby fourth, and then Shogun is after that one with Montparnasse Redwood, and then Tyrrhenian Sunshine just the back market. it is. Let's see if we can get to the bottom of why Paul Rhodes' colours are showing up wrong. In the top left hand corner, they've only got five furlongs to go. Um, Tiger Moth has been the lead all the way. And they're sort of queuing up behind Asiano Commander second, Marjorie Narnia third, then Destiny Ruby is after that one. A bit of a gap back to Shogun, Tyrrhenian Sunshine, Montparnasse Redwood is the back marker. Tiger Moth is the leader. By a couple of lengths as they race down towards the final three and a half furlongs. Tiger Moth, Destiny Ruby is second. Then Asiano Commander Shogun is now creeping into it on the outside. Marjorie Narnia being pushed along. Montparnasse Redwood trying to run on. So is Tyrrhenian Sunshine. There's plenty of chances, but they've got to get to this Tiger Moth who races down towards the final two furlongs with a clear lead of a couple of lengths. That Shogun is going really well in second. Marjorie Narnia still there in third. Then Destiny Ruby, Asiano Commander, Montparnasse Redwood, and Tyrrhenian Sunshine into the final. A furlong and a half, and it's still Tiger Moth. Shogun throws down a big challenge on the outside. Marjorie Narnia looks good for third, but it's Tiger Moth in the lead with less than a furlong to go. Tiger Moth is still in the lead. Shogun's trying to wear it down, but Tiger Moth is still the leader. Tiger Moth, the lead is just half a length. They race up towards the line. Tiger Moth is going to take it. Tiger Moth wins it from Shogun second, Marjorie Narnia third, and Asiano Commander after that one. And took until the final race, but the professor's off the mark. A diminishing lead. I fancy Shogun to take it over another furlong or so, wouldn't you? But don't get national flat races over longer than two miles, do we? So Tiger Moth, the winner for Paul Rhodes, in Shogun for Leon van Rensburg, second. Marjorie Narnia for David Robertson was third. Asiano Commander for Hims was fourth. Destiny Ruby for Graham Clutterbuck was fifth.